Hey, how's it going? Welcome to the GB Talk Show with Nina and Hirwe. Hi guys. Uh, today we're going to be talking about all the new great stuff that we have coming up and uh, you know, I guess it's only right that, uh, that my colleague uh, as the lady gets to choose what we're going to be talking about first. Well, I think the first thing we need to mention might be the new Zion, Jordan Zions that are coming out. Definitely, definitely. I'm all about it. So. Uh, Right here what we have is, uh, currently we only have the grade school sizes, you know, or the kid sizes, but, you know, stay tuned. The adult sizes are coming in as well. And obviously, I'm super excited about the shoe because it's the first signature model for Zion Williamson, who's been playing like a beast lately. I don't know if you're fo following uh, or keeping up with the NBA. He's putting up ridiculous numbers, you know, all highlights, dunks, and everything. So. Uh, First signature model for Zion Williamson under the Jordan brand. Uh, you know, it's the same setup like uh, with Russell Westbrook. Yeah. So, uh, you know, I'm. I'm. Uh, first, I have to say that I, I like the aesthetics. I mean, we talked about the details. Do you have like a favorite thing that you want to point out? Well, I like the small details. Uh, let me just also show you another colorway that we have. Nice. The uh, purple. I don't know the official name. It's the purple. <laughs> this is the black and white. This is the purple. For now, let's call it purple. Uh, so they have like sweet, cute little details uh, where you can see uh, his logo. So ZW. And on the on the tongue, on then you have it on the hill counter. Uh, also, it's also visible. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, right here. Yeah, great, nice details. And then also like sweet things. Uh, you can see like maybe like a letter Z. Oh yeah, yep. The Z is screaming at you right here. So. Cute, cute little details and uh, the shoe itself it's uh, it was made to be very durable uh, but not too bulky so yep. I think it's a great combination of both Definitely. Uh, with good technology inside air strobe all the way around just like with the uh, PG and KD for those of you who know the air strobe I mean it's a basically a guarantee for comfort and you know you have to keep in mind that Zion Williamson he's a, he's, he's a big guy he's huge you yep. know so his shoes have to give him comfort, have to give him security, they have to be durable. And, and as Nina pointed out, I mean, these are all lightweight materials, but you can see that they are at the premium level, that they will be durable. Uh, and and uh, another detail, I guess, that you can point out, you can see what they did with the tongue here, where it's really thin, mm -hmm. different than uh, unlike uh, any other shoes that we're going to be talking about today, but it has reinforcements right where you need them. So it's kind of similar to the LeBron 18s, but overall great, great things with the shoe. Oh, and uh, you mentioned the details. I think we can also talk about a, a W yeah. right here, which yeah. also serves to protect, you know, this area of the shoe. So just great, great things going on. But uh, since this is not the Zion 1 review, I think we have to move on and uh, stay stay with yeah. all the other uh, news because that's primarily what we're talking about all the new stuff that's coming in so i'm thinking uh let's let's say we're going to throw a curveball and we're going to talk about something completely unexpected now yes completely unexpected so something coming from under armor uh we have so you know that all great basketball players and anybody actually uh needs to also work out besides the regular Hit the gym, hit the weights. Yes. <laughs> so that's why Under Armour is uh, always, uh, he's there working with uh, Dwayne The Rock Johnson. And if you smell <laughs> what The Rock is cooking. <laughs> I think everybody loves him. Uh, he is very, very persistent in regular activities and staying fit. And he's also huge. <laughs> <laughs> he's really big. Talking about huge guys today. <laughs> so they may, they, there is a special project in Under Armour called Project Rock. Uh, this is his new training shoe that we have it in store. So um, you can see it's very, very lightweight and very breathable, which needs to be. But also you have additional security on the heel yep. for uh, weightlifting, weightlifting. Or anything you may need. Uh, the hover technology, hover technology, amazing for comfort and stability. So come try it out. Uh, yep. It's a really, really good shoe. And, and, and the color, I mean, you know, these days it's all about the crazy colorways with the shoes and, you know, this, what are we going to call it, neon yellow glow. <laughs> it's not glowing the dark, but it should be. 
Basically. Uh, yeah, but uh, I mean, it just it just looks looks really really great, and it kind of reminds me of of the of the Curry Flow Eight because you know it's all one part upper. Yep. So uh, and I love the Curry Flow Eight. They're basically like my go-to shoe these days for playing basketball, and uh, I think I think that this shoe I, I haven't had the chance to try them on uh, as much as I would like to. I just kind of tried them on in the store, and I can say my first impressions are you know just super okay. positive. And uh, speaking of Under Armour and uh, Cartier, I think that we can move on to, to Chef, to the Chef, <laughs> another the chef. another player who's been dominating lately, you know. It's, it's becoming normal for him to drop 10 three-pointers during a game and like take maybe 15 shots for it. So like, he, he's playing like a true beast. And uh, I always say it's gotta be the shoes. I mean, that's from the old Michael Jordan commercial, but this year, I think Curry did something really great with his entire signature. signature line, and this is such a step forward. And what's best is that there's so many colorways, but at the same time, they're keeping it simple. You know, yes. a lot of players will have colorways coming out, with, you know, uh, great details, messages, and this and that. But I like it with Curry. All uh, we have how many? Five or six colorways right now in the store. I'm not sure, like but it. it's it's you know keeping it simple. We have the blue, the yellow, the black and white. Uh, like, like solid colors, yeah. kind of all over. So, but they are very, very um, like attention drawing colors. That, that's so. that's a good way of putting it. And uh, we chose these two colorways. They're not the newest ones that have arrived, but we chose these two for a specific reason, and that's because the NBA playoffs are coming up. So, if you you know if you have your favorite NBA team, you want to support them, you might want to consider getting your player's favorite shoe in the team colors. Obviously, here we can see the Golden State Warriors colors, and uh, you know you should definitely keep that in mind come playoff time. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna move to another NBA player, NBA team, but staying with Under Armour. So, yes. over to you. <laughs> so also, Joel Embiid. Uh, so if you want to choose a colorway that suits your favorite NBA team. You might think about uh, Joel Embiid. It's a very, it's a great shoe. Yep. Uh, and so this is just one of the colors, colorways that we have. Uh, but something. Just yeah, obviously this is this is the you know it has the, the Philly Sixers look to it. So I'm liking a lot, and you know keep, keep it in mind. Uh, well, let's let's stay with the red, blue, and white, but for a different team this time. <laughs> and this is a new colorway that dropped. I don't know if you can recognize the shoe right away. It's the PG-5, and of course, if it's the PG with these colors, it's the LA Clippers colorway. So uh, definitely check it out. As we said, uh, with the Zion, it has the Air Strobel, so does the PG-5. Uh, I mean, you, you just have to try on that technology to see what we're talking about, yep. how much comfort it brings. So that's that. Uh, we're gonna move on to uh, one of your favorite uh, cities in the United States, maybe? Yes. So, so the Brooklyn, uh, we have Kyrie's, the Brooklyn colorway. I love the detail on the back. So the Brooklyn Bridge. Brooklyn Bridge, the black and white. If you've ever been there, it's an amazing sight to see. Uh, so it's their colorway. Uh, of course, we have other other colorways as well, but sticking with the NBA teams, you might yep. also like this And this one. is actually the, the most recent one for, Ky for yes. the Kyrie 7s. Yeah. And if I'm not mistaken, and I'm not, I was checking out with the uh, guys here from the store, this is glow in the dark, which is a really nice touch right here. You know, obviously can't we, we can't show it to you right now, but we'll figure out maybe a social media post or, or something on Instagram, whatever, uh, where you might be able to, to see because it's it's cool. You know, just this tiny part of the shoe that glows in the dark, nice touch. Um, but we're staying with Brooklyn, but no, uh, we're no longer going to be the black and whites. We're going to the Red. retro blues from, from the New Jersey Nets, even when Drajan Petrovic played for them. But these are the KDs. We have his number seven here. Uh, again, love. Air Strobel in the shoe. I mean, I love it. You know, it's... It, it, Very it, memorable. Yeah, definitely. It, it, it will leave an impression. Yes. So, you know, this is, uh, this is nice. I like it. I like it a lot. And uh, lastly, something that's not so new when it comes to it, but we have the Dame Sevens, um, the colorway inspired by uh, his victory. 
by his 50-point game in the playoffs against Oklahoma City Thunder. You can see on the hill tipper also? Yep, right here, the, the number 50 for how many points he scored. And I think this is so cocky, I'm going to say, because, you know, Dame Lillard plays for the Blazers, whose main colors are black, red, and white. And obviously, you know, he comes out with a shoe in the colors of the Oklahoma City Thunder. So that's basically kind of like saying, hey guys, I own you. Which, okay, Oklahoma is not doing good at all this year, but still, it's it's a, it's a you know, a brave move, so to say. Yeah. You, need, so, you need that kind of, uh, I would say... Attitude. Yes. Yeah, definitely. Gives you confidence. <laughs> uh, and I guess that covers the, hey, your favorite NBA team colorway <laughs> segment of Choose the show. <laughs> Uh, I'm, I'm sure all of you are aware how hot uh, Jordan 1 releases are and drops and you know we have to have these raffles and uh, it's, it's just difficult to cater to everyone to make sure that everybody has the same fair opportunity and that's what we're trying to do you know just to make sure that everybody has a chance to get the shoe because there's a lot of questions and comments uh, yes. about about the whole raffle process but that's especially given the the pandemic and everything, this is what we're safe, going with. The safest way, yeah, to keep everybody satisfied and also cover the safety measures considering the COVID-19 situation. Yeah, so, so thank you guys. Thank you a lot for the understanding and for, you know, uh, playing by the rules and, you know, just helping us make this more fun for everyone involved, so to say. So uh, I was talking about the Jordan 1s. Uh, yeah. we, we, you know, we had a string of great Jordan 1 uh, drops and releases, but now I want to talk about one of my personal favorite Jordans. I mean, just the, the, the number in the series, and that's the 11s. Uh, these are obviously uh, uh, a low version of the 11s. Uh, what's it called? Legend Blue, I think? Legend Blue. Legend Blue, or I would just call them, you know, coming the, soon. The, yeah, coming, I, I would call them, you know, the uh, Jordan 11 low whites. <laughs> You know, but the baby blue details. Baby blue details, definitely. I mean, <laughs> the translucent uh, 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 sole of the shoe, and you know all the all the right details are here, just like with the originals. So. Uh, so the number is also interesting fact. Uh, so it's showing 25, not 23, which we know is Jordan's number, uh, because it's the 25th anniversary of the release. So it's also a fun fact for you to know. Uh, and actually, uh, yeah, the 25 is in here. So right here you can see it. And, but you also have, you know, obviously the regular 23 that's also appearing on the shoe to, you know, because Jordan fans need to see that number 23. Yes. You know, it, it may be 45, you know, for that season that, that he, uh, when he came back, but Jordan fans want to see the 23. Everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> uh, since we're talking about the 11s, we're going to talk about uh, uh, black uh, cements, the elephant prints. I know a lot of people, it, it's weird for them to see the 11s without, yeah. the, uh, without the patent leather, but I don't know, I kind of like this approach where, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's a nice remix, so to say, of, of the classic. Maybe more breathable. Oh, definitely. I mean, look, look at this, all the this mesh, around, yeah. uh, uh, mesh that you have uh, going around. Obviously, you know, a lifestyle model, you're not going to be playing in them, maybe you could hit the gym, lift weights, but basically this is a shoe that you're, you're gonna be, you know, kicking it in, walking around, chilling. So, uh, another nice 11s that we have, and... The newest one. The newest one. <laughs> so, uh, the red colorway, of course. Uh, Classic. Yeah, the, they are released recently. So, the difference between them, so, so 11, uh, they are comfort. Uh, so meaning, so the patent leather doesn't go all the way around. It's yep. more they have like small holes and more breathable mesh. Uh, so it's maybe more lightweight for you. Yep. And also the you can see the sole. It's not the typical 11 yeah. sole. So you know here we see the classic how it works for the 11s, but here we have something completely different because again this is a lifestyle shoe, a shoe that you're going to be wearing you know all day long. It needs to be comfortable for you. Yeah, and it's definitely more comfortable, you know, the 11s, you need to break them in a little bit, but these, these are, you know, take them out of the box, put them on, boom, yeah. you're good to go, so. I tried them on, it's really, really comfortable, so give it a try, you might like it, so it's gonna be, you're gonna be stylish and comfortable at the same time. Yeah, that's it, that's <laughs> it, and uh, I think that pretty much covers it, right? I think we, uh, we went through everything, 
in case you know we forgot something make sure to tune into our website the, the new section the coming soon our social media you know we're on Facebook Instagram Twitter uh, LinkedIn we're everywhere so you know you'll, you'll be able to find all the news and as always uh, thanks for your support and thanks for tuning in thank you guys enjoy bye